An internal investigation is now being conducted into the SS Badger's ramp failure. The incident happened during unloading in Ludington two weeks ago, and the repairs will take months to complete. According to Crane's Grand Rapids Business, the company that owns the Lake Michigan car ferry is now looking into what happened. The president of the company says such an incident has never happened before. The impact of the Badger's early shutdown may not be known for a while. And that's key for a city like Ludington that relies heavily on tourism, particularly during the busy summer months. 13 on your side's Charlie Tinker has reaction from a pair of local business owners who say they're already feeling it. So it's really part of the, the Ludington tradition to welcome the Badger in every night, hear that horn blowing and uh, you know, see it coming in the harbor. Chris and Jenna Simpler own a pair of bed and breakfast just a few blocks off the Ludington waterfront. And we have been impacted a little bit. Cancellations for August, she says, have doubled in comparison to last year. So we are feeling that a little bit. Um, I think about 10% or so of our business comes from uh, Badger uh, guest. Making the move to Michigan, in Jenna's case, back home several years ago, they looked to the quaint lakeside getaway as the ideal place to put down roots. This beautiful property happened to be on the market during the time we were looking. The historic Cartier Mansion, named for businessman, lumber baron, and two-time Ludington Mayor Warren Cartier, who had it built circa 1905. And continue to tell the story of that space, so it's just been a great project. Wanting a bit more, though, around a year ago, the Simplers added the historic home across the street built by Cartier's father to the portfolio. It's only three days in, so it, it looks pretty bad now, but we have plenty of time to catch up. It's a little too soon to know what kind of impact is. This is pretty unprecedented. Helping slightly, says Brandy Miller, who heads the Ludington Convention and Visitors Bureau. The area did see a strong start to the season which began in May. We've seen tremendous numbers. The car ferry now out of commission for the remainder of the season. Miller suggests they'll have to wait until later in the year to fully understand the impact of its absence. This is a, a tremendous asset and attraction to our area. There are still, you know, a lot of reasons to visit Ludington and we hope people um, will still make the trip. Ultimately, you know, we're going to be OK. Uh, Ludington's going to be OK. The things are fine. Um, but it's, uh, you know, it's unfortunate. The Simplers say their thoughts are with the Badger's crew as they work to find a fix, adding that guests calling to cancel have been nothing but gracious. We're all trying to make the best out of a tough situation. In Ludington, Charlie Tinker, 13 on your side.